All right, we're back in. <laughs> Second time. Uh, all right, we're at Lake Bed Temple. Gonna do it. I'm trying. It took forever to get here, but we're doing it. Iron Boots Ahoy. Yeah, it does make it faster. It does make it a little bit faster. All right, how do I blow you up? Uh, using the water bombs. I know. Uh, not yet. Not that one. There's one below you. Whoa, that lighting. Uh, you blow that thing up. Might want to equip the water bombs. Well, I don't want to fuck anything up. Yeah, let's put them on the left. Oh, I can use the air. I can apparently... Yeah. Oh, you can't so use you the place arrow. on that, it creates a geyser, and then you put another one on the geyser that lifts it up to the, uh... to the rock. Perfect! Perfect, John. And you're into Lake Bed Temple! Perfect. Nope, you're not! Good thing you opted for 10 instead of 5. I don't think it's gonna wind up making a difference, but still. I hate that you have to get the water bombs for this. I really do. I wish they could just convert them when you get inside the temple or some shit. <clears throat> I don't know. That feels so, so stupid. It's one of my bigger problems with this temple. Even though its design is pretty cool. Yeah. It's uh, it's also by far the most complex dungeon we've come to so far. It's also I pretty. think out of the first five dungeons, it's the most complex. You don't need to fight. <laughs> Ignore it. Can't fight that. I can fight whatever I want. You can't, though. Uh, if you want to use bomb arrows, you can't. You can't. Can you, you do water bomb arrows, even? Uh, not underwater. Uh, Link, go up. Up and away. He, he's... Okay. Yeah, just face fuck the wall, whatever. <laughs> Link, what are you doing? Link. This wall. I love granite. He does. I love granite and sandstone. Just feel this smooth texture. And here we get to deal with. Oh man. Oh. Ah, uh, choose. Jelly, 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 jelly. Don't scoop that jelly. It's poison. <laughs> How do you know? Ah, uh, because the purple chews give you shitty, shitty poison jelly. Scoop that. The red ones are good. That gives you a uh, red potion. You just start the dungeon off with ten. Yeah. Yeah. Ah, oh, you missed the fucking good chew jelly. You missed the good red chew jelly, man. Yeah. What did you just replace? The Gale boomerang. Uh, okay, yeah, that's mine. I don't think you need that yet. Or I mean, at any point in this dungeon, I can't remember if the boomerang comes up in here. I wish that the, uh... More the bombs. Twilight... Nah. They're giving you bombs and arrows. I want. I wonder what they want you to do. Not yet. Well, they're gonna want you to. I wish I that... I thought that's how you fought the boss. Not... But we're not at the boss! Would you... God damn, stop going... You're maxed out. You have no need for money at this point. Zero need for money. Oh, uh, there's a red chew if you want to get some red chew jelly. Yeah, I do. Scoops? Yeah. How many hearts does that restore? Eight? Eight. Good job. Yeah, I did it. <laughs> I rememberized. Are you sure? Are, am I sure I didn't just guess? Bomb arrow time. Yeah, it is. Dude, those water bombs look so cool. The little piranha thing, you fat part. Why wouldn't I? Sh why wouldn't I shoot the, the skinny part? part? Yeah. Gameplay wise, it's so you have a bigger target. Logically, it doesn't make sense. And. Uh, None others in this room. No others in the room. None others. None others than that. Oh no, I need a I need hookshot. 
Uh, you can kill them without the hook shot. Yeah, but then I have you to gotta get them straight to... them. And... Oh, yeah. Yeah. You gotta get him to charge the wall. Yeah, I'm not doing that. Okay. That's fine. Like, there's... I don't know if there's uh, a Helmosaur in this dungeon that you have to fight at any point. So that's cool. As soon as you enter Lakebed Temple, they just barrage you with new enemy types. We have the jellyfish, the clams, the chews, the Helmosaurs. <laughs> yeah, get my wall sick. Try him. Yeah, Tektites up there. Tektites are oh, wait. though. Is it? Small key, probably. Probably. It's probably. Oh look, rupees you can't use. Oh please don't be. Okay. If this is bombs. You know it's bombs. <laughs> oh well, at least you get to look at the cool bomb graphic. Yeah, they do look pretty dope. Yeah, go into the main chamber. <laughs> Clearly done in here. Uh, oh, this still isn't the main chamber. Fuck. Oh, uh, what, are you, what are you gonna light the fucking thing off? Oh. The main oh. chamber here is where I get confused in this dungeon, because the main gimmick of that that center room is the rotating stairs. What? This dungeon just came back to me. Really? Yeah. Like, real vividly? Not as and vividly. you get introduced to uh, the Lizalfoses! Oh, missed. Too bad they're chumps. Okay, as long as it came back to you, this should go sp pretty smooth, right? It's relatively back to me. I, I remember that there were a few parts that I was confused about. And... So, one thing that I kind of remember here is that you don't spin it the first chance you get. I just don't remember where the first spin is. After the first spin, it should all be relatively easy. It's just... Fuck. That one... Part in the beginning. Uh... <laughs> yeah, but you just come down and, like, you circle around. Uh... The chest over there, I'm pretty sure, is a sm either... The dungeon map or a small key. Tektai! Worst enemies ever. No, they're not. What is good about a Tektite? They drop hearts. Most enemies do. But it's useful. Tektites are annoying little shits. Oh no, you know what? This is where our differences in playstyle come in. Because I spam the shit out of Leap Attack, which is oh it, it which is terrible against Tektites. Yeah. You do not. Not locked. Okay. Ah, more tech titans. Uh, this is also the first, like, more open dungeon that we come to. Even the two dungeons that come after this are not that complicated. This is locked, by the way. Yeah. Because so you need the small key from that chest. Yeah, it has the water wheels. Actually, I think I have to be on the second floor first. <laughs> I don't know. Yeah, but, um... Even, like, Arbiter's Grounds and Snow Peak Ruins, which come immediately after this, are not nearly as complicated. Especially Snow Peak Ruins. That's, like, the, one of the most straightforward dungeons in the game. <laughs> Aside from the, uh, the sliding block puzzles, which, if you're not good at sliding block puzzles, can be a pain in the ass, but I am... I fucking rock at those. <laughs> this might be where you need... Did you loop back around, actually, to the beginning? No, they're both the same. Okay, shit. Hold on. Yeah, it's, like, the, the... Oh, yeah, you did loop back around. I think the, the hard part here is just remembering these are all... Yeah, infested with piranhas right now. That's fine. I don't think this is where you need to be right now. <laughs> Fucking no, Z-Lock. Totally not. Yeah, again, the hard part is just figuring out where you make that first, uh, stairway transition. And then the rest is mostly, uh, straightforward. Alright, let me go back up and go out of the main room. Yay, vines! Vines are pretty good. Yay, vines! Some of them are pretty funny, I think. Oh. Social media! <laughs> Boys with beards! <laughs> Social media. 
Get out of here, Tumblr dog. <laughs> Fuck you, Ron. <laughs> Fuck you, Ron. <laughs> Fuck you, Ron. <laughs> <laughs> the idea of a Tumblr dog is what gets me. I didn't do shit. I thought it might. Uh, just start rotating the bridge wherever. I can't like, rotate the bridge. I have to be on one of the sides that I, it has. It has to be on an empty side because he can't jump up to it. See. Uh, what about from the bottom? No. Okay. Well, figure out where the hell to go. Let's see. Wait, isn't it just leading back out? Yes. Maybe it is from the bottom. Oh. I'm a fucking... What? Because the bottom lets me go over to the one, to one that I can jump on. Yeah. Okay. When you said do it from the bottom, I thought you meant like from this one. Yeah, I did. But I'm going to take credit for the idea that you just proposed that I told you. Because it makes me sound smart. <laughs> oh. Wait, there is none over here. It's on the opposite side, probably. Right, yeah, right here. Yeah. Or right there, yeah. Okay. That's the opening bridge rotation that you need to make. Okay, cool. Now it's smooth sailing. Ish. Smoothish sailing. Smoothish sailing. I'm not saying we're sailors or know anything about sailing. Well, I do know this. A smooth sea never made a skilled sailor. Uku, fuck off. Get out. Nobody ever liked you, Uku. Why does she keep getting stuck in fucking... Uku Jr. looks even weirder. I don't We want. have to... At some point, we have to show Uku Jr. off. Later. Do I have yeah. No, I don't. No, you have to go uh, uh, clockwise around the room to get to the key. Tech Oh, I have to pull another thing to get down to that. Uh, check that door that on your left, or that you just passed. That's open. We haven't been here, right? Oh, I can't go through there anyway. Yeah. I have to start the water. Might as well just check all the rooms just in case. Because at this point, we're like, we're basically blind. I don't know, I kind of, <clears throat> as a, as a, as I remember a the general concepts of this dungeon, I just don't remember specifics of it. Which is one of the very few dungeons in the game, unfortunately, that I don't just... Rotely, yeah, it, no, it's just one of the, those that, unfortunately, I just don't like rotely have memorized. There we go. Fucking dungeon map. Fuck you. I don't want you right now. Uh, it does tell us where we haven't been yet, so. Well, I can go first things here. first, key. Okay, we're on the right path. I, re I remember the Helmasaur part here. <laughs> Weirdly enough. Weird specific details. Yeah, I... I don't know why I'm bracing myself on the wall. I don't know either. Mobomb arrows. Is it? Yeah, that's bombable. Oh, right. It plugs the geyser. Oh, it makes that one go And high. then this section of the dungeon is about getting these rotating things moving. You might as well just keep bomb arrows equipped. I guess. Use them so much throughout this dungeon. No. Oh, well. There is something you can do down here. Fight. I think I can blow that up. If I can't blow that up. Blow what up? That? That looks pretty bombable. We are wrong. <laughs> uh, the, uh, we have to come back here like way later, I believe, when the water <coughs> level's higher, because that raises the bridge, and that bridge, I want to say, leads to a piece of heart. Could be wrong about that. No, I think we laid it. Oh, blah, 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 blah. We what it? Blah, blah, blah. We light it? Light up them them devil's lettuces. Can we do anything in here yet without yeah. the hookshot? Oh, this path over here that I totally didn't look at the mini-map for. 
Oh, I'm stupid. Being very hard on myself right now. Yeah, you are. You're just like calling yourself oh, stupid. It's such just being generally. I got. A mean I guy. just. I just got such such self-esteem. You cannot. Oh, there. Such and esteem compass. issues. Compass. Is that the compass? No. Oh, that's a key. No, there's no way they would give you the compass. Why do they randomize the fucking keys like that? Though? You mean the the chests? Yeah. Been complaining about that the whole playthrough. It's so weird. Incomprehensible the way they do that. Can I do anything here, or do I need to go open that other door? Uh, I believe you need to backtrack to the locked door. There's, I don't think there's anything you can do in here until you get those things rotating, <laughs> which you do in the other room, I want to say. Yeah, oh, I rage. wish I remembered more Lake Bed Temple. Lake, oh, well, I like, like Lake you Lake Bed know Temple. what? You know what? As Let's a... pretend we're playing this for the first time and just explore and learn. Because, like, obviously we don't remember our ways around, so we'll just do this like we are doing it for the first time. I'm surprised nobody's like, M did Mike really just do what I think Mike just did? Yeah, What'd you do? Yeah. Sneeze, sneeze into the mic? No, I turned around and fucking killed that, uh... I shot that thing Oh, with a bomb. bomb. Yeah. <laughs> I let him charge past me and then I turned around and went, oh. Oh, well, you'll get plenty. You'll get plenty of bomb arrows. I was... Yeah, we like, my out. anxiety was getting up over the, uh, the rotating bridge thing, but it's at, you have way fewer options to rotate it than I thought you did. Yeah, it's not super hard. I was getting like, oh god, there's so many options that you're getting so many pathways to do here. Nah, actually. Um, the first really complicated dungeon after this one is the sixth one. The one after Snow Peak. Where you get the Rod of Dominion? Oh, the... Yes! Yes, that dungeon. <clears throat> Boy, is that one gonna be fun! <laughs> and then you get City in the Sky after that, and City in the Sky... Uh, I... Rocks. Well, wait a minute, the Rod of Dominion... Uh, wasn't there, like, a whole backtracking section of it? Yes. And it's, like, timed or some shit. Yes! I... I might take the controller from you in that dungeon. I kind of want to take it in Arbiter's Grounds, because, man, I really, really like Arbiter's Grounds. I bought the goddamn Link Amiibo for the spinner! For I and Hyrule Warriors! Alright. That's what you get for that. Yeah. Uh, I want to say you need the hook shot for that. Nope. Oh, there's something you can blow up. Wow, I'm blind! No, it wasn't. It's not clearly visible. No, it was really, really obvious. <laughs> No, no, not from the angle I looked at it from originally. No, but when you showed it to me, I was like, wait, where do you look? Oh. Oh. No, it still wasn't. I mean... Dude, just smell this Gatorade. Oh, yes. Fierce. Fierce blue cherry. And... Did I just ask you in the middle of a Let's Play to, to smell, smell Gatorade? You went, smell this. I actually did. That's... that's gotta be bombable. That thing on your right? Yeah, I don't know yet. Oh, go back through the door and check. You got 13. Is that 13 arrows and 13 bombs, no, or what? 13, it's 13 bombs. The arrows... oh, I mean, it counts for Oh, that. it doesn't It doesn't uh, count as an arrow. Well, Wait, what? Fucking Christ. Wrong button. Plink. I was just gonna do normal bombing. Yeah, that's fine. Because I don't know if you lose power because of it's on an arrow or not. You don't. Okay. Now, is that just a complete loop? Might as well check it out. Yeah. Since we don't remember it, just treat it like it's the first time and explore everything. <clears throat> yeah, it just loops you to the other side, I think. Yeah. Uh, and is there a cl Oh, yeah! These! Oh, this the man. I thought. No, the mini boss is uh, later on. It's gross. You have to bomb arrow it. Because you don't have the hook shot yet. Yeah, those aren't mini bosses. No, I thought there was a mini boss. It was there pretty much. There's one that's kind of similar. Wait, what? These go. went 
I'm pretty sure I have to do the rotating platform section first. Oh. Don't you have to power it? Oh, it's a good thing you came in here, because that's probably important. Yeah! Pretty good job. You're maxed out! So? Why? Because <laughs> of your overall count. You said you're going to make a count. No, I, no, I'm not going to count them when they're maxed out, because that's zero. You smashed hots for zero rupees. <laughs> There's some stupid ass jumping that you have to do in here later on, if I remember correctly. Like, you have to s jump to very specific ledges, which is terrible. You know what? Lake Bed's not quite as bad as I made out to be like an hour ago. Lake Bed's alright. <coughs> it's pretty cool. It's the weakest, but, you know. I like Snow Peak better, even, even though Snow Peak's like a nothing dungeon. Yeah. Because it's got, it's such... It's got a cool weapon. It's got a cool weapon, it's got a cool mini-boss, it's got a really cool boss, it's got two really good characters in it, and it's got a great visual design. But, like, as far as layout and puzzles go, it's shit. Yeah. Like, there's very little going on in, like, uh, not in, like, in Snow Peak. And then Arbiter's Crowns is just like a partial retread of the Spirit Temple. Or not Spirit, uh, Forest Temple. Hmm. Uh, so what's the plan here? I have to trigger that to get some water. <laughs> some water. Water, water, water. Water's not running yet, though. Yeah, I have to get it. Boo! <laughs> I got brain damage now! <laughs> Hi, I'm Link. I'm Lonk, the hero of Dur. Her, I'm Lonk, the hero of... Is it dinner yet? Is it? I'm... Hi, I'm Lonk. I'm the hero of potatoes. Mmm, potatoes. I saved the whole Irish island. I saved the whole Irish nation from the potato famine. I saved the whole Irish nation from their excessive masturbation. That's not what my people were known for. I think we were dead on with the potato thing. Potatoes and whiskey. Yeah, but you're part Polish. Potatoes, whiskey, and vodka. Beep. <laughs> Making ethnic slurs against my people. Oh god, what was this? You're like? lucky you have a Polish friend. Well, I have a black friend too. That doesn't mean I can. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Preemptive beep. Don't do that. <clears throat> I'll never get sick of seeing that bomb, that water bomb design. Yeah, ladders on either side. What you get? I am so bad with ladders. Yeah. Oh, I thought you were walking past them intentionally. I didn't think you just missed. All right, now we got the water flowing here, and it's just a matter of what rotating the steps so the water flows the right way. Yeah, but I gotta. Oh, nah, you need a hook shot. There's a hook shot point right behind it. So I have to come all the way back here. If you want that chest. Oh yeah! yeah! I love you, Twilight Princess. So good. Nothing happens if you, if you bump into the wall. Damn, it's cool. Yeah. Damn, that is cool. That is cool. It is. That is the best. Uh, I missed. Wah! I suck at Amy. Nah, it's fine. Yeah. I you're playing on the inferior version, so some allowances are to be made. Some allowances. Fuck this version. Just the garbage. The tip is allowed. I've gone like two hours in this recording session without complaining once about the mirroring. I'm getting better about it. And f but like it helps that I don't remember this dungeon to complain about how it's mirrored. Yeah, but what about Zelma's Selma? Or whatever. Zelma? Yeah, her. What about her? She had a dingus. A dingus? You're losing it. 
I'm all right. All right, now this is rotating. And I don't exactly remember which. Ooh, close. Shimmy, shimmy, shimmy. You're maxed out. What are you doing with the pots? You fucker. You did that? Did you do this intentionally? Yeah. I don't know if I'm supposed to be doing this right now. I don't know. Uh, I also don't care. One of these rooms is... Uh, is this a mini boss room actually? Looks like it might be. Oh, it is. It, it, I'm pretty sure this is a mini boss. It looks pretty mini bossy. Uh, not yet though. No, you have to I... come the other way. No, you have to come in here from the other way. What other way? You, there's a different door back out in the uh, rotating platform room. No, that was the other. No, no. there's another door. <clears throat> Positive. Trust me. Pretty sure I need the hook shot to do that mini boss. No, you get the mini. You get the hook shot after the mini boss. You come in here to get what a key? Yeah. So I got a key. Yeah, you come in here to get that, and then that opens, I think, the other door. Don't fall the fuck off. Be yeah, alright. I'm a professional. Whipping the camera around like that. Yeah. Because you see it leads around to the yeah. same direction. And then I you have... just needed the key, because there's a locked door here. No. No, Elmasar. I'm not dealing No with action you. for you. I'm not dealing with your shit. No! Oh, I got the Pop the Magic Dragon song stuck in my head again. There it goes. Whoa! Oh, the, the nose piece on the helmet looks stupid, but the mask. I'm a big fan of that blue hood and the yeah. scarf in Hyrule Warriors and Zelda U. I'm a big, big fan of that. Debonair. Hey, Electric Jellyfish! Baronade's cousin? Baronade. I had the hardest time with Baronade when I first played Ocarina. That boss was a roadblock for me. Really? Yeah, I had a really hard time beating Barony when I was a kid. It took me like two hours. <laughs> to be fair, Z targeting becomes it makes Zelda some Zelda games like super easy. I don't know what that has to do with me struggling with Barony. <laughs> oh, I thought I ate you. Yeah. Hey, camera. <laughs> Fucking great camera. Though. Good job, camera. Where are you? Where is it? You have to look up, like Goma. Yeah, look up. Yeah! This is cool mechanic! <laughs> oh, this fucker. Yeah! Good old fashioned, gross looking monster. Like the Demon of Song's gross cousin. And it's got tadpoles on its back. Yeah, that look like eyeballs. Uh, now I don't remember what the gimmick of this fight is. Spin attack, spin attack, spin, spin attack. attack to win attack. You just spin its little tadpoles. And then you have to clear all the tadpoles out before you can do anything else. I don't remember. And then I know there's a phase two to the fight, to the fight and I don't remember. Oh, he just jumps around a lot in phase two. And you can, uh, <clears throat> you can launch bomb arrows into his mouth or something. Or he just jumps around now. Dong. <laughs> there we go. Oh yeah, this is the phase two, I think. And even though they explode on impact, he still swallows them like yeah. King Dodongo and they blow up inside. <laughs> what a chump. Yeah, I think I just put him on blast. 
shots fired at disgusting toad monster. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, ew. Yo, I don't want to touch the chest. I like how Midna bolted because of how disgusting that thing is. Did you catch that? No. She's just like, no, it's too gross. You take care of it. <laughs> it's a long chain with a claw. The hookshot, yeah.